when our development is delayed during, you know, the stage that Anne talked about, that adult stage of development, you know, we feel secure and confident when we're alone, but we can slip back into codependent stage of, um, uh, stage of behavior in relationships, right? Because we don't know how to show up in these relationships in a way that's not codependent. But when we become conscious of this duality, we're reluctant to try new behaviors or to assert ourselves for fear of losing the approval of, of others. I know when I try to step out from hiding behind the persona of codependence or behind one of the survival personas in my, my first marriage, it, it took a lot, <laughs> right? To sort of go, okay, I'm going to assert myself. Okay, I'm going to say, no, it's not fine. <laughs> It's like, you know, it, and, and it, it does, it's like, you you know, that fear of losing the approval of others, that fear of losing the relationship, that, that fear even of, you know, doing something wrong, right? Like that was always part of it for me is like, you know, and I would talk myself out, I'm not entitled to this and, you know, I shouldn't, this shouldn't matter to me so much. And it's just amazing what our brains will do to keep us in this, this dysfunction of codependence. So, and, and again, we hide out, we're hiding out behind a persona, feeling like an imposter and really afraid to show up and be who we really are and, and, and to assert our needs and negotiate for them, as Anne had talked about earlier, a very important part of moving out of codependence. So our persona is the person we're trying to be or how we behave so we can be accepted, be liked, to fit in. You know, I was like, you know, the cool spouse. I was so, you know, I did all the great things. And, you know, even with my staff, right, I could see, I look back now and I could see, you know, codependence in my relationship with my staff, the way I treated them, you know, as I was, I was navigating through this myself. So again, our persona by nature is self-protective. And that's a part of the ego structure that's there to protect us from psychological distress and difficult emotions. And so we use it to help us cope in difficult situations, shores up our courage when we step out of our comfort of being dependent during that independent stage. 